safety top of mind for all school leaders as we start a brand new school year. That's right. This morning, 7 News reporter Jordan Johnson live at the Iroquois Central School District. She's showing us some new safety features. Hi, Jordan. Good morning. Good morning to you, Ed and Katie. Here at Iroquois Central School District, it's the first day back to school, and some parents may be wanting to know how the district is keeping their students safe. So to join me is Superintendent Doug Schofield. So can you kind of tell me the new measures that are in place here in this district? Absolutely, at Iroquois. Um, we really didn't want to keep waiting for the state to put safety first for students, so we took the initiative and did it, and we're supported by the taxpayers. And as you can see here on the wall, there's a blue box. This blue box is part of our blue light system. So any student or staff can pull that box, and immediately what will happen is all the doors are locked. There's announcements on all the halls on monitor systems, letting everyone know that we're in lockdown. The um, school resource officer then is immediately notified of the location so they can respond. And we just implemented having a school res resource officer in every single building. And 911 is also called. So we have immediate response, backup response happening, and everyone's notified. And this is really going to provide a safe environment for the students here at Iroquois. And it is so important to provide that safe environment. Thank you so much for joining me this morning, Doug. And we are about an hour away from students coming back to school here in Elma. Live from Elma, Jordan Johnson, 7 News.